Yay! This is my favorite show. Your favorite show? Yep. Jay's Awesome TV is back. got for his birthday. James, what do you have to say about that? We can hardly see you. Ooh. Yeah. So we got all this cool stuff and it is brought to you by James Awesome TV is back. Okay, let's get started. Yay! First up, we got BB-8. BB-8? Yep, a is a center time thing. This is one of the gifts that James got for his birthday. Now, we're only going to be sharing his toys that he received. So, this is something that he got. And can we describe it a little bit, James? It's a little plush. It's a BB-8 plush. Um, I think that's all it is. I don't think it has anything sp like in specific that it's supposed to do. Um, it's just a plush and it was super cute and James likes Star Wars. So that was something he was really happy about receiving. Right yeah, James? Yeah, and I want to see wrestling too. And yeah, you like wrestlers too, of course. Yeah, look. Awesome. And I believe these are other ones that you can get and purchase. To open Kevin Owens. Kevin Owens? Okay, so let's um, discuss what you got because we have a few more things that are not WWE related over here on this side. So we're going to go ahead and show you what he got in the packets. Then we're going to take everything out and just show you what's in it. So how about we just go one by one? So this is Kevin Owens. And awesome. And he beat his best friend, Chris Jericho. <gasps> Chris Jericho is his best friend? Awesome. Yeah. Look. Oh, that's one of your wrestlers, Chris yeah. Jericho, that you already have. So let's go ahead and open this box, and we can show you guys what is in it. It yeah. says he interacts with other tough talkers. Awesome. Push my back. That was so you have to push the back of Kevin Owens. Oh, they got Ooh, okay. Does he say other stuff? Yeah. Are you kidding me? <laughs> it's like he answered me. That's all he does. Awesome. Okay, and um, it's just called Tough Talkers. It says you can try them in the back. Let me see. Um, try yeah. by pushing the button in the back. Turn it around, James, so I can see the back. Okay. Sounds and phrases. There's eight sounds and phrases. Uh, push button to um, let superstars interact like never before. That's pretty cool. You get actually. John Cena falling to Roman Reigns, Kevin Owens, Bray Wyatt, and the Ambos. That is correct. You get John Cena, Seth Rollins, Roman Reigns, Kevin Owens, Bray Wyatt, and Dean Ambrose. So let's take them out of the box. So this is Kevin Owens straight fresh out of the box. Can you put him a little closer so we can see his facial features? Does it look like Kevin Owens? Yep. Yes, it does. And there's he, a belly on here. It, it's not working so hard. The it button just, in the front on his belly? Yeah. I think it's, it's on his chest. Does that one work, though, if you push it? Uh, let me see. I don't know. Uh, I James' do. daddy is gonna check to see if there's any other buttons that we have to push. We couldn't figure out what that was all about. The button seems to be pretty hard. Maybe it's just meant to be there. Um, James' dad's gonna check it out. So let's go to the next uh, wrestlers, James. Uh, the ones right here, WWE. We're getting into WWE. That might just be a, just a button that was there. Or... Samoa Joe. That's Samoa Joe. Yeah, James I... also got this one for his birthday. And we made a cut in the back so James can just slip them out whenever he's ready to take them out. Sometimes it takes a bit to open packages. So go ahead and open the back, James, and take some of uh, Joe and, out. And he's from NXT. He is from NXT. Yep, rip that baby open. Oh, yeah. 
<laughs> Makes it easier for him to take out on his Ooh, own. There you go. There you go. I was breaking. No, you won't break it. So there is Samoa Joe, and he's wearing um, just his regular trunks yellow. with yellow and black, and it's his not, black boots. He's not wearing red no more. He's not wearing red anymore. Um, this one doesn't do anything in special, it's just a figure, which most of them are that way. But James has such a good time playing with wrestlers, and there he is, from top to bottom. Let's go to the next one, James. Yep. What um, else did you get? This is another pack that James wanted. Um, these are actually, a lot of people have asked, who is James' favorite WWE wrestler, James. But who's your favorite? The Miz. The Miz. And a lot of people have asked, who is James' favorite wrestler? The Miz, inspired by his name. Well, his um, YouTube channel was inspired by The Miz. And um, James loves him so much that he chose the name James Awesome TV. And he comes in a battle pack with none other than who, James? Um, Maurice. Yep. Lovely. And that's one of James' favorite divas because, of course, that's the Miz's wife. So let's open those babies up. Not down one. All right. Let's open that up. Yeah, let's get these two up. Oh, and there they are, guys. That is Maurice and the Miz, and Maurice had a little bit of a collapse just a little bit ago. She fainted. Yeah. Yeah, and I got pretty a cool Miz. attire. Yeah. Sorry, getting my finger in the camera. That's the other Miz that James has. He wanted to show you guys. They have different facial expressions, actually. Yep. Which one's cuter? Let me see. Which one does Maurice find more attractive? Um, I think that one in the middle actually looks more like the Miz. Think so. Yep. What's your favorite? This one looks like the Miz, but he just, I don't know. There's just something different about him. I think the one in the middle looks more like the Miz. They should have done that one more. What's they should have put that one in the battle pack. Doesn't matter because they're the most, they, well, they're proclaimed to be the most powerful couple in the industry, the It Couple, uh, formerly known from SmackDown Live, of course, after the draft, and Shake the Superstar Shake-Up. They're now on the Raw brand. Yep. What do you guys think? Do you guys think this one looks like the Miz more or the middle? I think it's the middle one. Oh. And I think they did a pretty good job on Maurice. There's their attire from head to toe. I know they it. did. Miss is Miss TV. Yeah, and I know James's mom likes to watch the Miz. Is uh, it, it's on. Uh, you can get it on YouTube where it shows like his parents. My and stuff. son is a WWE superstar. It's yeah, so hilarious. Have you guys heard the Miz's dad? Definitely check it out. What's, it is so funny. What's your favorite Miz? The blue one or the black one? I like the middle one. I think it looks more like the Miz. Mm -hmm. Let's go on to the next battle pack. Yep. Who's the next one? Next. Goodbye, Mrs. Mm -hmm. Yep. The next battle pack is James' what? second favorite Ooh. diva. Who <laughs> is that, James? So I can look for you. Nate. You're what? So I can look for you. Rick Flair and Charlotte. The nature boy. And, um, and his daughter, Charlotte Flair. Now that she's being called Charlotte Flair, but the 16 time world heavyweight champion to your right. Yeah, and then for back and back and back. Yes, we are back. And I'm sorry for the delay. Well, you guys won't even notice this in the video, anyways, because we'll just start where we left off. But we had to take a brief little break. Because we had to empty out our storage. We opened up three times. We opened up three of them. Yes. Did we really? No, we haven't. We yes, did Kevin we did. Owens, Samoa Joe, and yeah, you're right. And then we did Miss and Marie. Yeah. Okay, so let's open this one and show them what we got in here. This is Charlotte and Ric the Flair. Nature. Woo! Nature of the War. The Nature, Nature Boy. One of Mama's favorites. I love plastic wrestlers, as you guys know already. I don't like plastic wrestlers. Because you weren't born yet. You weren't even thought of yet. That was Mama's time, when Mama was your age. Okay. Oh! oh. 
<laughs> Are you dropping wrestlers? Let's help you open up this package real quick. Never mind, he's got it. From SmackDown Live. SmackDown Live. It's the Dirty Superstar Seeker. And they came with SmackDown right here. Yeah, that's SmackDown. And they came with the Texas ship. What? You need help? Look. It's here in the Texas ship. Oh, yeah. He has his own championship belt. Cool, pretty awesome. That'll punch him out, punch him out. You're being pretty good at opening this now, huh? He has a good amount of practice considering how many wrestlers you've got. Push! <laughs> Do you have that one already? No. He has like two other little plastic belts. He says this is a new one. All right, let's it's get them out. The World Championship. The World Heavyweight Championship. Yeah. Cool. And I'm World Heavyweight Championship. Awesome. It's Ric Flair's. Oh. Oh. I hit him in the butt. You hit him in the butt? He does look like Ric Flair when he was younger in his younger years, yeah. He is now. Actually, yeah. Uh, you think it looks like him when he was in the 80s? Yeah. This. I don't think Daddy's listening. So, there we go. That looks like him a little bit. James gets Charlotte out. All right, so we're back, and uh, James is showing off his new, uh, couple new figures here. Ric Flair, the Nature Boy, the 16-time heavyweight champion, which now he is tied with John Cena recently. Yep. Uh, Cena now is a 16-time champion, and alongside with Ric Flair, who was that again? Woo! <laughs> no, who's, who did you get with Ric Flair besides the championship belt? Charlotte. Charlotte, <laughs> Charlotte Flair. Uh, also an NXT superstar who came on to the Raw brand at first during the draft and then and Superstar Shakeup. Yep, Superstar Shakeup in the SmackDown Live. So. Yeah, and it's on here. Yep, it's on there. So a good duo and uh, pretty good figures there. Uh, bring him closer, James, so you can see. This is uh, from CNF. Yeah, bring him closer to the camera so you can see uh, pretty much how they look. and. You can see Charlotte Flair there. All right. One, right. One, one more bell cut left. Yeah, let's take a look at one more double pack. It's is Tyson that? Kidd and Cesaro. Tyson Kidd and Cesaro. Comes with also two headphones. Headphones. Yeah. Go buy some headphones. And uh, as, as uh, James' mom said earlier, we have Ooh. these kind of pre-cut, so that way they're easier for James to, to pull apart. Cesaro. Wow. He actually looks he actually looks like Cesaro. So you know and sometimes these figurines don't really look like the true superstars, but this one does. Every ten hours Seamus. Yeah, now he's a tag team with Seamus, but back then he was a tag team with uh, Tyson Kidd. Um, so let's see, let's uh, let's show Tyson Kidd now. Tyson Kidd, who is also uh, with uh, Natalia um, in real life, I heard they were, in fact, they've known each other since they were kids. So uh, there's Tyson Kidd right there. And there's a championship right here. There's a tag team champion. Oh, yeah, built into his trunks. Pretty yeah. cool. Yeah. All right. You think the headphones fit in their heads? Oh, no problem. Try those headphones on. Some beats. And they can hear it, the people, before they can fight. There's some motivation music probably before they head to the ring, huh? Yeah. Pretty cool. 
Yeah, he got quite a bit of WWE merch. And let's show, uh, let's show him in front of the camera. There you go. Pretty nice. That's what he used to wear when he came out to the ring when, when he was teamed up with Cesaro at the time. But uh, yeah, pretty cool couple of figures there. And um, just different ones you can get. Um, that like it shows here in the back of the box while he's trying to put the other headsets in. Um, there's another one, a Raw brand here. John Cena and Kevin Owens alongside former tag team um, champions actually, Darren Young and Titus O'Neil. And there he is with his Beats by Dre. <laughs> and Cesaro and Titus is from SmackDown. Yeah. And this one is still at war and he's still war now. Uh huh. All right, so now that we finish all the figures. Yep, all these studies. Yep, so now we're gonna look at some other stuff that he got recently. Okay, this is the last day to eat. That's this is Seth Rollins. Yeah, that's Seth Rollins. It actually comes with a top, right? Looks like no. it could be like the armor. One in the bank and you sit. Yeah, well, yeah, that's what it is. It's a. Looks like body armor or something that, that, that they wore when they were part of the shield, I think. Yeah. It looks pretty cool. But anyways, the money in the bank is actually foam. That was just one um, little thing that concerned me about it just because it was foam because we have a cat and he likes to chew on sandals. So we're going to have to keep this away from him because it's foam. Um, I actually at first thought it was like metal or plastic, but it is foam when you feel it. The awesome thing about it is that it comes with this awesome uh, Seth Rollins uh, top, and it looks like the one, kind of like the one that James is wearing as Superman. But um, it'll be cool for him because he gets his top and he gets the money in the bank. Let's open that up. So it's a battle like a superstar, and we're gonna open it up and show you what's in the box. Yep. All right, James. So show your money in the bank. So that's the money in the bank. It is made out of foam. It does not open, but it's a pretty cool um, type of little, um, how do you say, just a little collector item to keep and just to have for play fun. And it does come with the top. It looks pretty small, actually. Is that very small? <laughs> what size is that? The box says that it fits a size 4 to a 6X. Does that look like it's going to be a 6X? <laughs> no. Yeah, but anyway, that's um, the top. And in fact, if you turn it around, James, turn around. No, not, not you turn around. Come this way, James, so we can see you in the picture. Okay, go back over here. That way. That way. This way. This okay. way. <laughs> okay, now turn around. The, the shirt. Turn the shirt around. Yeah, it looks okay. a little snug. Okay, so when you turn around in the back, there's Velcro. So, Velcro. yeah. You... Here, what is the Velcro for? I think it's to put it on. I think what it is is that it stretches out. It stretches? Yeah, see. You know what? Let's put it on him. See how it's going to fit. Because I'm not sure if that's going to fit him. Alright, let's try it. Honestly. Put it over the screen. Yeah. I don't think that's James' size at all. We'll see. That looks like really Place your really best, small. everybody. Yep. Will it fit? So guess who got his top on? He managed to get the shirt on. Yeah. Seth Rollins, right? Yep. And it fit. So I guess it's just supposed to be like maybe a little muscle shirt. I'm not sure. Do you like it, James? Yeah. And he likes his money in the bank. So that is it for that. We are probably going to stop here and just briefly show you what else he got and do a separate video for that because there's just so much to show still. So James, show him your snow cone machine. Just pull your box out. James got a snow cone machine from my brother, um, yep. from his uncle. And um, you don't have to pull it out to show the box. And we purchased a Candy Crush syrup. We will show this in a different video where we'll show you how we make our snow cones and have a lot of fun with that. Right, James? Yep. And you don't know what else we got. And then we also got, well, he got a Batman. Batman Snuggie from his other uncle. 
Um, and that's pretty cool, James, right? Yep. You're gonna be able to use this for winter. So James' favorite superhero is Batman and he loves it. And then he also got a game from them. And yep. James loves board games. So we'll show you that also in a separate video. Um, the Snuggie, of course, you guys know it's a Snuggie, so we might not show that, but the other gifts that he got, we might open them up in a separate video and show you what comes in it. This is a SpongeBob, just like um, a art set type thing. And then what else did we get, James? Um, let's see. Uh, that, the Angry Birds one? We Angry got... Birds go. We got Angry Birds Go, and we will show this one. This is actually Jenga. We will show you this one on a separate video as well, because I think that these will be fun to show, and James loves this type of stuff. Last but not least, one more? Okay, brief pause, everybody. <laughs> oh, I almost forgot about that. He took it back in the room. Bring it over here and show it. And this. He got a boogie board. Can you help him? Help? Can you help him, Papa? James calls his dad Papa. So James got this cool boogie board, and he's looking forward to using oh, this. Yeah. Really awesome. Yeah. When we go in the pool. Yeah, we will do another video. On this one, we'll probably show you in the pool with it. It'll be fun. Yes. Last but not least, James got a shake and roll chalk paint rollers. And this is washable. We're probably going to do a video on this sometime because he likes to do outdoor stuff. And I think it'll be fun just to kind of paint. Maybe just like a quick little fun video. Um, nothing huge because it's just paint, chalk paint, right? Yep. Alright, this is the end of our video. We're just going to end it here. Any other box openings we'll do in a separate video. Thanks for joining us. James, this is James Awesome TV. And any words, James? Last words? Thumbs up. Give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and follow us for future videos. Goodbye! Goodbye! <laughs>